And we're back with another Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes video. A bunch of new events in here. The new event, Training Droids. And they also updated the credit heist. So we're going to go into battle and do those. Yesterday made a video of all the updates they made. There will be a link in the outro to that video. And I also made a lot of goofy new intros, which I feature in that other video too. A lot of positive feedback on that. Also, we can see now that Kit Fisto, Wedge, and B2 Battle Droid is available in the cantina battles which is unfortunate because i need mods and boy i don't know if i want to spend my cantina energy on getting b2 battle droid or wedge which i think are both amazing let's go do these events and i'm going to try this training droid smuggling one first now there's only two completed battles that you can do per day so my suggestion is to do the last one first and if you can beat it that's fine but if you can't then you can go down to tier three tier two tier one but we're going to try that and I'm a little bit frustrated because I've got to use Greedo and I don't want to upgrade him. I'd rather be upgrading my regular Han Solo. We'll just see if I can make it through with these guys. I'm willing to upgrade Lando and IG-88 because I think they're going to be really good in this game for a long time, but I'm not really sure about Greedo. Oh, does he get two critical hits? Cool. So that's awesome. I do not want to lose any heroes, so I'm going to start the taunt early. Huh, I don't really want to do that. Let's do this. Oh, yeah, take him out. Oh, come on, you. You're useless. <laughs> all right, get some damage up there. Cool. I think Lando's going to carry me on this all the way through. 88's really good also. Probably those two are just going to be enough to get through this, I'm hoping. And because this is going to be an event for a long time, I don't mind getting them up to where they need to be. But like I said, I just really don't know about Greedo. I haven't heard good things about him. Someone asked me to make like a, a Cat Bane and a Greedo review, and I'm like, I don't know. I, I just haven't heard anything good about those two guys. Oh, you got to hit me anyways. All right. Well, we're down to the last round. So this is not going to be too hard. Hopefully I get some ability mats that I need. I don't know if they're going to give out a ton of those, but I'll take whatever I can get. Hopefully I get some good rewards. See, I want to save these guys for splash damage. I don't want to pick them off. Ouch! All right, come on. Get at least two critical hits. Thank you. Boy, he just is carrying me all the way. Uh, how do I want to do this? Let's take out the guy with the most turn meter if I can. Oh, yeah. Do that. Ouch! Bye, Greedo. Well, I probably don't need him. I don't think I will. Let's see if I can make it through it without him. I mean, if I can finish this without him, then I'm not going to worry about it. Cool so far. I think I'm not going to have a problem with this. I'm not sure if this is going to be the harder of the two or the other one. So, you know, my suggestion is, you know, Lando and 88 for these. My goodness. They're just so good and they're useful in other places in the game. Mostly because, oh my goodness, Lando is rebel and Scoundrel, which is very cool. Same thing with Stormtrooper Han, and then 88 is Scoundrel and Droid. Hey, I need tons of those, but I could use like 100 of those more at least. Oh boy, look at all those training droids. Okay, I haven't heard anybody having like a training droid crunch. A lot of people are having a gold crunch. All right, so let's go to the new credit heist, and hopefully this is not any harder. Same team. So I guess it's pretty important to have uh, scoundrels. And the reason why I'm really like excited about Lando is that Lando is a rebel and a scoundrel. And it seems like all of these events are using one of the two. So it just seems like, like a must-have hero at this point. I really think he's just not optional anymore or anything like that. How do I want to do this? I want to see if I can get turn meter reduction on him right there. Cool. Oh, do some damage, 88. Oh, that wasn't very much. All right, two critical hits. Thank you. All right, take him out so we don't get a retaliation on there. Oh, I don't know if it matters. All right, and there we go. Round one done. We're going to round two. All right, two critical hits. Keep this going. Oh, yeah, that's great. I think I want to take out one of these guys in the back. Thank you, so I don't want to have to fight him again. Minimize the damage I take from them. I'm not willing to miss right here uh, Because both of them have to get crits. So I think I'm gonna save that for round three. I just don't want to chance that at all 
Yeah, I think it's better to save that. Because if he missed, then I would have to do the cooldown, and that would have been a mess for this last round. Hopefully there's more than three. Okay, we got four. I think I'm going to taunt. I want to save my guys as much as possible. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, ability block. Oh, this is got this way got a lot easier. Wow, I thought this was going to be a ton harder, so I'm glad that this is not as hard as I thought it was going to be. For some reason, I thought this was going to be nuts. I mean, it is hard, but I kind of knew that they were coming out with this. I mean, uh, they, they've had the credit heist, and scoundrels have been important for a while. So, Lando. That's all I got to say is Lando, 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 Lando. Even if you don't use him in his squad arena, he's just so useful in, like, almost every event out there. What? Five million gold? Oh, my God. What the heck? I wonder if that's a fluke. Let's do that again. Oh, my God. Five million gold? Is that right? Five million gold. Wow. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, let's do that again. I wonder, what is, what are the possible rewards? Anywhere from 1.5 million to 10 million. Oh my God. Well, we got to do that again. <laughs> I'm actually really excited. I need that cold so bad for so many heroes. Especially for Jawas, because right now I'm in Jawa mode. Because I think they're going to be important in the new raid. I think that they're necessary for so much stuff. The... The new raid and also for getting those critical damage mods. Okay, let's see. Come on, Lando. Pull through. Look at that. And Stormtrooper Han is sucking up the damage. Very cool here. <laughs> Five million gold. I cannot believe that. Oh, man. I needed that so much. I've got, like, all those Jawas need to go to, like, level 80 probably at some point. Ouch. There he goes, Greedo. Who do I want to pick off? Let's pick off this guy here, the highest turn meter. And let's see if we get two crits. Thank you. All right, we got one left. I don't think I'm going to have a hard time. Cool. Boy, let's see what kind of gold we get here. All right, what do we got here? Let's see, just ping on one of them. Two crits. Come on, give me two crits. Oh, three crits. That's amazing. Yeah. Awesome. All right. So I think that's over. I'm just going to put that on autoplay. I don't think I'm going to have a hard time with this now. <laughs> what is Chewie doing? He's just uh, taunting and hanging out in the corner by himself. All right. Let's see what kind of gold I get. What kind of gold do I get? Two and a half million. Wow. So I just got seven million gold. Boy, there's just so many people I need to upgrade. That is crazy. A lot of people ask me how I have so much gold. Well, here's the deal is I don't upgrade the heroes that I can't get to seven stars. Like Han Solo, three Jawas down there that are at level one. Don't take them much higher than level 50 unless I think I can take them all the way up with gear and mods and the whole deal. And I've only got about 10 heroes that are fully developed. Pretty much all the heroes here in the top row and about half the heroes in the second row. I'm currently working on Palpatine and Lando and 88 and the Jawas is what I really want. And the reason why I think the Jawas are so important is that I've gone against some people in the squad arena and they're using these critical damage mods. And I've got to take a whole bunch of my Jawas up to finish that. And those battles are hard. They're very challenging. And then they're also going to get 20% potency and a assist on a special move for the new AAT Tank Guild Raid, which is not out yet. Where is that? I want to know where that is. I don't think I've ever saved up 10 million gold, so I have just, I don't know how hard this raid's going to be, but I'm sure it's just going to be a huge drain on resources. Okay, guys, let me know what you think of these new credit heist and this trading droid challenge. And right here in the middle of the screen, there's a link to all of my Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes videos. If you click the link, it'll take you to my last video, which I did all those really funny intros and also went over the community notes that came out yesterday. And as always, thanks for watching.